Greetings and salutations! You are watching this sometime in August. I don't even know the date. So, we're gonna do this one. Um, so there are absolutely a lot of strategies to fight these guys, but what I found to be the best is to just use the Blossoming Ancient against the Blingtron 4999B, the Protectron 022481, and the Protect Protectron 011803. Um, because these guys behave as critters, but the guys in the back are still crazy strong. So. Um, you can't really do a lot of beasts because even though they behave as critters, their moves are mechanical, and mechanical is strong against beasts. So, oh, did you just win a game? Okay. Yay! Okay, so, what you're going to do, um, this is, again, there are lots of strategies. This is one that I found is best. Blossoming Ancient is a pet you get from the in-game shop. Um, it's adorable, and it changes to look like whatever season it is. So right now it's pretty springy and then it'll get summer, it's kind of summery and then in the winter it's like purpley brown, it's really cute. Anyway, so you're gonna grab, uh, you're gonna keep sunlight up. You wanna cast sunlight every time it's available. Um, it's not like most weather apps, but weather ones, which uh, only last, or no, sorry, it is like most ones that last time, but you're still gonna play it on cooldown. You're gonna photosynthesis on cooldown. And then you're gonna poison branch. Now sunlight hits everyone, so it may not be doing a lot of damage to it may not be doing a lot of damage to uh, the front guy, but it's hitting these guys for the full amount, which is what you want. So and just keep spamming poisoned branch, and then you'll play sunlight on cooldown, and then you'll play photosynthesis, and you'll just go through the brush. You're just gonna keep doing that over and over and over again until they're all dead. So you definitely, you don't wanna wait till it ends up. You definitely wanna play this one. That's kind of the important part of this strategy. So you can see it's hidden, it only hit him for 90 something, but it hit uh, everything else for like 222 and 333. Oh, you can see if my camera's there, but it's it's crazy strong. And then you're gonna photosynthesize again. <coughs> and he did the uh, Armageddon move, which negates his fail safe, which is fine. He can do that. <coughs> and then hit with poison branch. So you get double the health back if it's in sunny day, which is another reason why we want to make sure we play like that. So he's getting hit for the full amount. But he is mechanical, so he is going to come back. <coughs> and we're going to heal. And they don't very often... Um, they don't very often, uh, crit, I have noticed. It's pretty hard for them to crit, so as long as you kind of just make sure you do the rotation, don't be like, oh, he's almost dead, uh, cast the, do a poison branch, don't do it. Um, it's just really worth it to do the rotation. where you could stop, um, but I honestly think it's worth it just to keep it going just to make sure that some of stays up. You could absolutely just uh, recast it when it dies out, but honestly I think it's just worth it to do it like this. Because we're right at the last bit, you don't have to recast any day. 
I would still keep up photo services because he does have a stupid eye on camera. Well, he's gonna be dead this turn, so it really doesn't matter, but yeah, if it takes you a little bit longer if your guy's not quite level 25, then absolutely keep the keep the rotation going in. But that is it. Relatively straightforward. Um, you can do it with one pet, which you can't say for a lot of these fights, so that was pretty fantastic. Um, but yeah, that is it for today. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you found that helpful and or amusing. Like and subscribe if you feel so inclined. Have a beautiful day.